Yes, I'm very impressed with him at the pace that he picked the stuff up. Um, he looks like a bright kid and that he can go far in this industry. This has been a very great experience for me and I hope one day I can, I can train and become uh, a professional chef and make a good food for people. I discover many things. Polo making isn't so easy. It's much harder than it seems and it, it takes a lot of effort, you know, and a lot of hours just to sometimes get a small scene right. Sometimes you have to do it over and over and over. Uh, when I first met all the guys, uh, it was kind of strange. Everyone was in their own circle, but after a while we started warming up to each other. Um, and I actually found out that they were quite nice. They weren't as mean as they looked. I think it was a great opportunity for me to work with people I didn't know and to it it built up my self-esteem, my self-confidence, and my self-trust in people. I learned a lot about the location manager, how to do goods, how to organize everything, and I will do, will do it again and again and again if I grab that opportunity will come in my life. I think the whole team has, has gained the benefit of, of broadening their horizons. I think, you know, we've, we, as, as people, we've never actually considered things like filmmaking. It's always, it's always been normal, general, more common things. And I think it's given us all the ability to just broaden our horizon and just to look outside of the box, you know, in terms of like things for careers and jobs. Uh, like now I'm in prison, I'm writing my own book. The name of the book is uh, The Way to Prison. I would love to make a movie about my book. My next film. A gangster love story. If I if I have to make a film, I will I will prefer a horror movie.